Hello, my name is Tim Lafferty, Texas Instruments Isolation Product Marketing Manager. I'm going to explain the basics about creepage and clearance. These are terms that describe the distance between conductors in a high voltage isolation barrier. Let's start by talking about clearance. Clearance is the shortest distance through air between two uninsulated conductors. These diagrams show different examples of how to measure clearance distance. Having adequate clearance for the voltage level and environment that you are designing for will prevent an arc over. An arc over or arc discharge is when air becomes ionized and the current begins to flow shorting across the isolation barrier by arcing through the air. Now let's talk about creepage. Creepage is the shortest distance between two uninsulated conductors along the surface of an insulating material. Let's look at the diagram of different examples of how to measure the creepage distance. You can see the creepage is the measure of the shortest distance along the surface between uninsulated conductors. Having enough creepage distance for the voltage level in the environment you are designing for will prevent tracking. Tracking is a breakdown of the insulation material along the surface to make a conducting path to short across the isolation barrier. Different insulation materials have different susceptibility to tracking. So materials are rated with a comparative tracking index, CTI. The CTI level of a material is a factor in the amount of creepage distance needed in a design. Creepage and clearance cannot be discussed without mentioning the environment the system is operating. Pollution degrees are four levels used to grade the environmental conditions around the isolation barrier. These four levels range from pollution degree one, which has little or no non-conducting dust, to pollution degree 4, which has conducting dust such as graphite or metal, condensation, rain, and or snow. So when looking at creepage and clearance distance, the pollution degree must be taken into account. The amount of spacing needed changes greatly if water or conducting dust is present in the system. So when you are looking at safety standards, there are tables for creepage and clearance distance given for a voltage and pollution degree that must be followed for a safe design. TI offers many digital and analog isolation devices with a variety of creepage and clearance measures to meet your design needs. Go to www.ti.com isolators to see all TI isolation products. Thank you for watching.